guys, it's Tanya. I'm coming to show you my design team project for Antique Papery. This is my first video of the year and I apologize for that. Things just kind of went whack this um, January 1st. My kids got sick, all three of them, then my husband, they had the flu. And so it's just been a lot. And um, so I finally gotten a chance to sit down and do something. And um, I was feeling a little bit uninspired until I watched um, Amity Bloom and she did a tag journal and a hexagon journal and she said you know if you are uninspired try making a journal out of something else so I decided to go with the circle um, and this is the spine this is the back this is the front and these right here are antique paperies paper and I believe it's called Born House and um, they are just really really pretty papers and very boho chic i guess that's how you would that's that's the style um so it closes it opens like this and closes like this um i think i put five signatures in here i don't know if i showed you the side so the side has a lot of little tassels and things like that and um this is uh just a pocket with some things in here and um, it was so fun to make something a little bit different. Um, I have a lot of blank pages. Always, always have a lot of blank pages in here. Um, so um, I try to have blank pages in my journals for to write. Um, and then this is like a door. Then you have some more. And the reason why I put these in there is because I just love the way they feel and look. They're really, really pretty. Coffee stained paper. Oh my goodness. And then this. Um, I wanted to keep the shabbiness of it, so I just used masking tape and vellum. This is part of the paper. Oh, and these journaling cards are from Emily Bloom's, um, I think, a French um journaling cards or something like that so this is part of antique papery and then this is a little tuck spot up there and then we have another one and i forgot to put something in here so it was another one like this and then just more blank pages with tabs on them and then we have this right here and it's just a pocket and then you flip it and it has a belly band which is another tag that I made and then right here you have a circle twist out and in each pocket um, each circle is a pocket so you have Some tags that I made. I'm gonna put those over on the side. And then this is just a little flip, and it has another tag right here. I tried to keep um, a lot of them a circle shape, you know, like the flips and stuff like that, um, just to go along with the theme. Um, then we have another pocket with another tag. That one is just. I didn't back that one or anything. And then we have some more um, <clears throat> tags and journaling cards. And then we have a belly band with a fabric tab tag I made. I'm sorry, I said tab. Um, I love that. And then here is another one. I don't know if you guys could see the gold underneath there. That's how that one looks. Move that up a little bit, I'm sorry. And then we just have more pages, more pages, more pages. And then we have the back with another lace um, pocket. And we have some more cards, journaling cards. And that is it. Um, it was a really quick flip through. I love, love doing this size um, journal. I love the circle. I love 
everything about this journal um, is really really pretty and um, it was it was nice to do something a little bit different get my mind off of things um, <clears throat> I plan to do a couple more craft well some craft with me's I'm just waiting on some lighting um, the reason why it's so hard for me to film during the day most of the time is because I homeschool and you know that takes up a good portion of my day so I hope you guys bear with me this year and I'm hoping to get better so um, I hope you guys this new year is has been amazing um, this January has been amazing for you all and um, I hope to be back in a couple like in a week with um, two new journals so um, yeah be blessed bye <laughs>